I have bought some more Litecoins. Welcome back guys, it's CryptoRocket here and in today's video I'll be talking about why I've bought more Litecoins. I'll be talking about some of the news behind it, fundamental news behind it and also the price uh, analysis and the technical analysis behind my decision. So guys, uh, just a full warning guys, please do your own research before copying my trade. Do not buy blindly, it can go wrong. Um, I think it will go up. I've done the risk analysis. That's why I've bought it. I've got my stop losses in place. That's why I've bought it. But again, please do your own analysis and do not jump into this trade because trading is quite a risky business and no one gets 100% right. You win some, you lose some. I share all. I share a lot of my trades on Twitter. You've seen I've won some, I've lost some, but you can see full transparency when I'm taking the trades. So guys, just a quick warning, guys. Please do your risk analysis. This is a day dangerous business so guys let's get into the fundamental news now why I've bought Litecoins so I'm, I'm sure you're aware about Litecoin hits 100 nodes on Lightning Network so that is quite a big news and fundamentally it is positive it shows that the project is still ongoing they're trying to improve the uh, uh, project and although Litecoin re uh, lately last year wasn't as good for fundamental drivers with the failing of Litepay. They they seem to be making another comeback. So is it a long term investment that I've made? Probably not. Please watch my um, Bitcoin video, guys, where I've talked about my targets for Bitcoin, and I think they will break out. Um, so I talked about Bitcoin breaking out in two days and it, and it did again I'm not saying I always get them right it, it that that time it worked so you need to keep an eye out for Bitcoin guys currently Bitcoin is looking good so that's why I've bought it but I wouldn't say this is a long-term investment and um, I'll see how it plays out if you are a long-term investor you could start accumulating um, or dollar cost averaging if you're a trader you might want to buy it and then I'll talk about where I'm looking to sell near the end of this video so that is a big news guys Litecoin still has a lot of work ahead as those hundred nodes are completely dwarfed by a larger network Bitcoin Lightning Network has 51283 nodes so again do not get too excited but Litecoin is making a step towards the right directions and lots of the newer um, lots of the exchanges are backing it as well so it is good so can Litecoin get out of Bitcoin shadow I don't see it as competition I, I see you know there can be more than one coin so I don't see it as a competition but you can see Charlie Lee doing back to doing what he does best kind of shilling or hyping his own coin and it's good to see as well guys they've talked about UFC UFC has been promoting it Ben Askren and he's been doing his thing guys alien payment and it's good to see Charlie Lee back on Twitter try to promote so coin coin gate is supporting litecoin network now but yeah charlie lee is back on twitter as well i mean he's always been on twitter but he's been trying to hype it up as much as he can with his ufc stuff so you can see litecoin is trying uh, to promote itself and it's not just for litecoin guys it's also good for the whole cryptocurrency market if any cryptocurrency does well it gives us a positive kind of reputation because like uh, cryptocurrency still has a negative connotation behind it so whenever any coin does well it is good for the whole cryptocurrency market so testnet or not litecoin has uh, has outperformed the leading cryptocurrencies as it recorded gains of 21 percent that's another reason why i'm looking to buy litecoin guys because it, in the previous uh, run or uh, i don't know if you can call it a bull run the breakout that we saw guys litecoin was the leading in it litecoin had the most gains if you compare to how much Bitcoin gained, so that's why I'm. Uh, whenever Bitcoin does well, uh, I try to buy the coin that is leading, and it's not pulled back that much uh, uh, yet. And so that's the reason why I'm looking at it. So that present payments are not considered final until miner records them in the blockchain. A process which may require up to an hour for larger BTC payments. Litecoin Network records transactions outside the blockchain allowing nearly instant settlements at minuscule fees does that affect the security of it there are rumors or there are people talking uh, about it maybe i'll make another video but that is another interesting point yes it is making it faster but can it still have the security of a blockchain Second layer solutions were regular, uh, were regarded as the Hail Mary for blockchain networks during the high fee bottleneck that occurred late 2017. Lightning like solutions have always has been proposed for Ethereum in the form of Raiden network. Starlight and instant settlement layer for Stellar uh, is currently 
running a testnet so we'll have to see how litecoin plays out but there's fundamental news behind it a lot of my best trades happen when there's fundamental news backing my uh, technical analysis so there, there's been some fud as well previously when you see fuds litecoin crashes but we haven't seen that much of a crash so when negative news doesn't affect the price you could look at it as a positive thing for the coin things to look out for for litecoin core uh, which reduces network fee transactions by 10x as well as private transactions onto Lite litecoin blockchain as well as growing adoption of the litecoin network and atomic swaps litecoin aims to provide a cryptocurrency that complements bitcoin store of value proposition as well as differentiating it itself as an efficient effective financial payment solution to anyone and everywhere in the world so they've tried to kind of they've dealt with that fud quite well Binance are adding litecoin and trx uh, pairs to trade number one to spread cryptocurrency but i think something more important than just donating cryptocurrency to other people is actually the process of educating and binance is a exchange that i like i'm, I'm buying binance i've talked about uh, looking at binance and is a coin that i'm buying it's looking quite good i'm in a long position for bnb um, so if you are in cryptocurrency guys make sure you watch my videos guys I talk about some of the coins that I'm buying um, so Chainlink is a coin that I talked about in my in my I think it was in this video I talked about some of the old coins I'm looking to looking to buy so you can see link is there that's a coin that's been doing really really well so yeah so that's another positive thing so whenever price starts going up you see kind of news following it and that is exactly what is happening coingate implements lightning network for litecoin payments light litecoins lightning network reduces fees so you can see some a lot of the positive news coming as well merchant adoption the biggest missing piece in merchant adoption is there are no tools to incorporate cryptocurrency into their entire business model the point of sale is only the start of it and even there there are no great options available so you can see guys there are a lot of things that are going on for positive news for litecoin guys so that's another reason why i am looking at this coin to trade and now let's get into the technical analysis so i talked about um on in my tweet that i'm buying it that there are some fundamental positive news now we're looking at technical analysis so it has jumped uh, bounced off perfectly of the 618 Again, I didn't have my order left there, and it's not that it's jumped off 618, it's also a double bottom, guys. So if it breaks this neckline, again, I've got in an early entry because it's, it's risky to get in early, I suppose. But if you're not in this trade, wait for it to break this level, guys. I'll pull this down. If it breaks this level, guys, then Litecoin should see some really good from a technical point of view guys you can expect Litecoin to go up to kind of the 236 kind of the, the, that level and if it breaks that the I mean I've talked about Litecoin having a target of $50 that's a very far-fetched one but 40 45 dollars is something that I am looking at at that level and it is a very big possibility if it can break above it guys it is a possibility and the reason why I say is this I made my, in my previous video I talked about it uh, corrections are usually two waves up so if this was like wave one uh, then we can expect another leg higher and that would lead to around the $50 mark again these are not exact signs um, these are just technical analysis tools that you use and you have to the more confidence you have the more chances you have it's like a lawyer the more um, um, the more evidence you have the more likely you are to win a case but it doesn't guarantee you win a case so that's just how I look at trading but there's double bottom bouncing of the 618 range uh, it's above the 50% level if it can break that kind of neckline it can go up so that's the technical analysis behind it RSI is looking good my indicators are looking good and that is why I'm looking at uh, Litecoin the target I have um, Again, I've got, if you watch my videos, I've got two uh, TradingView accounts in my other account. I think it was, um, but for that was the level I was looking at, guys, for my uh, initial targets. I will take some profits um, in the previous highs around this level, guys. And then I'll let the other one run and see how far I can get out and get up. And then it, again, I might potentially add two more Litecoins if it pulls back. So that is what I'm looking at for Litecoin. The third thing was keep an eye out for Bitcoin, guys. So Bitcoin is king. We all know that. Oops, excuse me. That's not a very pretty chart. Um, let me use another. Should I get rid of some of this for you guys? Sorry, sorry about this. 
so Litecoin I was looking at Bitcoin I was looking at this um, this pullback range guys the 786 level and it did it just touch this box it didn't touch the 786 level but it touched that equal measure and move down i got in around here this could be another potential good buy in bitcoin i've added litecoin because litecoin if bitcoin goes up one or one percent litecoin should go up 1.5 or two percent that's why i've bought litecoin but bitcoin is looking good for a leg higher as well and that's why I've bought like uh, bought more more. Uh, that's one. That's another confluence for this trade, guys. So there's three things going for me for this trade, and my targets for like uh, Bitcoin was this resistance level. If it can break above previous highs, guys, around here, then I I, I should expect Litecoin to hit around that level. So if if it hits that level, we're gonna see potentially that breakdown and and the expected breakdown that everyone's thinking. Or there's another scenario again. I'm not gonna go into a Bitcoin analysis video. You can watch this Bitcoin breakout in two days or Bitcoin to 6k in February or the Scartley pattern. So you can watch those videos for my thoughts on Bitcoin. For up to now, it is playing out well. Um, but again, we, no, we don't know. We need to watch. We need to keep watching the price action because uh, there are patterns scenarios where it can break out here or it could move up to there as well so there are scenarios that we need to be looking at for bitcoin because bitcoin is king if bitcoin breaks down this litecoin move might not see that much action so thank you very much for watching this video guys i hope you've enjoyed it if you have enjoyed it guys smash that like button subscribe to my channel i don't charge anything for my videos i don't sell any courses if you want uh, to help me guys please smash that like button subscribe to my channel and share this video with your friends and family that would mean a lot to me if you have any questions guys i've got my email address below so just scroll down and email me guys and i'll try to get back to you whether it's a technical analysis or there's a coin that you want me to review or even mentoring guys if you want to some help with technical analysis or trading you enjoy my uh, trading style e email me guys i'll try and help you out for mentoring or any kind of coaching if you want or help or any questions guys so thank you very much guys smash that like button subscribe to my channel also guys if you want to win 250 dollars worth of xrp smash that like button subscribe to my channel and turn on the notification button below guys make sure to turn on the notification button and i'll yeah, come back with great more videos if you have any other coins that you want me to review in my next video let me know and i will uh, have a look at it so thank you very much guys smash that like button subscribe to my channel and i'll see you guys soon with another great video hopefully the next time i talk about it Litecoin will make a move up thank you very much smash that like button subscribe to my channel and i'll see you guys soon with another great video thank you very much